what's up? Today I'm going to be filming a video of gross things that I do. After I'm done with this video, I'm going to have like no friends and everybody's going to think I am disgusting, but I don't really care. And I'm sorry if my glasses have a glare on them throughout this video, but what can you do, blind people? like me nothing let's get on into the embarrassing list of gross things that i do something that i feel like a lot of other people uh have a guilty pleasure in this and that is that i love popping pimples and blackheads it is the most satisfying thing ever i actually have a pimple that's like really big on my cheek right now that i popped this morning and it was great i'm always like popping like blackheads and pimples on my boyfriend's back and i always ask him to do mine and stuff relationship goals honestly i love it like i'll just see someone and i won't even know them that well and i'll just be like hey can i pop that pimple <laughs> Next is, since I was a little kid, I've always, like, put my fingers in my nose and, like, picked my nose and stuff. Like, I'm not always necessarily picking my nose, but, like, for some reason, one of my, like, anxiety tics is to, like, put my finger in my nose. So I'll just be sitting there like this. All my friends are always like, Grace, get your finger out of your freaking nose. What are you doing? And I'm just like, no. And going along with boogers, another gross thing that I do is I pick my dog's eye boogers and I feed it to him. So, I don't, I have nothing more to say about that. Next, I fart all the time. That is not ladylike, but do I ever act like a lady? No. I fart all the time in front of Alex, my boyfriend, and... I fart louder than he does and more often than he does. At least I finally found someone who will accept me with all my gas and glory. Also, I always rip off my freaking nails and I've done this for forever too, which is why I get acrylics pretty often, but as you can see, I recently ripped them all off again and I've always had boy fingers whenever I don't have acrylics because I just go around and rip my fingernails off until they freaking bleed. It's disgusting and my fingernails like are so gross I don't ever want people to see them and they probably don't want me to touch any of their belongings with them so. Oh, hello sir. Uh, I always hawk loogies. I don't even think about it, like, I don't even think about, like, where I am or anything. Like, one time I did it in the middle of a church service. I was just sitting there and I was just like, <sighs> and people looked at me. I learned my lesson that time, but I still do it all the time in my daily life. I share ice cream cones with my dog and, oh, there he is. <laughs> um, I share ice cream cones with my dog and I let him lick all over my mouth, so... Judge me. He's my son. I birthed him. Another thing is that I always bite the skin off my lips, just like peeling my nails. Um, if I'm like super OCD about my lips, if there's any like dry skin or like skin sticking out or anything like that, I will like rip it off or like bite it off and then my lips will have like cuts on them. And then it hurts to like put chapstick on. But I'll never stop. Frick! Something annoying is that I don't really cover my mouth. Uh, I do it if I'm like in public or around someone I don't really know, but if I'm just at home, I'm just like... <coughs> <coughs> and I actually hate it when people don't cover their cough around me, but then like I do it to like my family, so... I love cleaning my ears and I especially love it on that rare occasion when you get a nice chunk on the q-tip i will literally just like look at the chunk and be like oh yes something that my boyfriend really hates is that i always try to like stick my tongue and my fingers in his belly button but i only do it because it freaks him out another thing that i do is i talk about poop all the time um i'll like explain manji's poop to people like manji had a weird poop today it was like long and hard and then like half diarrhea yeah or i'll like talk about my poop like i'll be like i had rabbit turds today yeah i always talk about poop and i like bring poop into conversations so i don't know what's wrong with me but a lot of my family does that like my mom and my sister we all talk about poop all the time so 
I also belch and like burp all the time and that's something that I had to work on because I used to just like burp in public and I wouldn't even think about it again and that's really like not polite but yeah I've gotten better about that. Uh, in the summertime I walk around with no shoes a lot and then my feet get like really dirty and nasty and I just like don't even care and I'll just like wait till I take a shower to wash them. Something else is that I never wash my makeup brushes and you professional beauty gurus are out there are probably just like you dear god what is wrong with this girl her skin is gonna break out and be disgusting but it's just not something that I like to do. It's a task that I'd rather just avoid. And also, I lick my fingers when I eat sometimes. Uh, I'll just be like eating chips or something and I'll just like lick it off my fingers. And some people cringe at that, but hey, I'm still gonna do it. And the last thing, I love to drink pickle juice. I know other people that like this, but then some people are like, that is so disgusting, why are you doing that? And like telling me to stop. But especially when I drink alcohol, if I ever like take a shot, I like to take a shot of pickle juice after because you literally can't taste anything after. And I am a pussy, so I need that chaser girl. Pickle juice is the best one. It's called a pickleback. So if you haven't tried that, try it. They even have it available at most bars, so. Hopefully some of you guys do some of these gross things so I don't feel as nasty. If you're foul like me and stuff, we can be friends. Comment down below if you do any of these things. It's out for the world to know that I am... I'm disgusting. I will have all of my social media linked down below. Be sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I will see you guys in my next video.